Welcome back to the channel. There's a new version of PixInsight available. It's version 1.8.9.3. If you want to update PixInsight, it's not possible to do this in the program itself, but you have to go to the so-called PixInsight software distribution system where you will find the latest version. It's available for Windows, Mac OS and Linux. Since PixInsight is running on my Windows machine, I just download this version here. While the files are downloading, I would highly recommend to make a backup of your uh, workflow icons. And you will find it in PixInsight and the bin folder. Just copy and paste to a new folder. And I would also recommend to back up the so-called TensorFlow DLL file. Open the downloaded new PixInsight version. Click install and it will do its thing. Just press finish. Close PixInsight and open again. Wait a few seconds. And now you can already see that we have a new PixInsight version. And most probably you will also get a notification about new updates. I would highly recommend to do this to update. Just uh, select all and apply. This will take a few seconds. Press OK. And restart PixInsight. Click yes. And PixInsight will restart now. Click OK again. And here you can see it's a new version 1.8.9.3. Now we can check for our process icons. And as you can see, there's none. So it's really a good idea to make a backup of those. Just select your process icons, go to the PixInsight bin folder, and just paste all. Try again, go to process icons, load process icons, and here they are. But you will encounter a new problem. Since I also included uh, Starnet2 in my process and icons, uh, PixInsight is complaining because with the new installation of PixInsight, StarNet2 has been removed. So we now have to reinstall StarNet2. Just go to YouTube, type install StarNet version 2, and you will find a nightly made video from this channel, which I did in the past. And just follow the instructions. I will show you here again. Um, first, you just open the video description. You can also open the description to this very video and open the uh, link for StarNet. Just scroll down and you will find a version for Windows and Mac OS as well. And you will also have a separation between uh, PixInsight older versions and newer versions. So, of course, we will do a new version and we will do a fresh install. And this is really important after unpacking StarNet2, only take those files without TensorFlow DLL and copy it to the PixInsight bin folder. After that, just go to Process, Modules, Install Modules, and press Search. You will find an additional module, which is StarNet2. Click OK. And here, just select it and click Install. And here you have the information about the successful installation. Just close and reopen PixInsight again. Try again to open your processing icons, and this time you can see StarNet2. 
And this time you will get no error message because Starnet 2 has been successfully installed. Just double click or you also can go to process, all processes and just click Starnet 2 to open. I also want to show you that there's no problem with Blur Exterminator after this installation. Just apply it to the image. And here you also can see what the plugin Blur Exterminator is actually doing. I hope this is helpful for you. Thank you for watching and see you next time. Clear skies.